Graduating from university is actually one of the biggest milestones not only for our undergraduates but also their families. It is quite a big family event for someone to graduate from university. But now this significant milestone is actually entirely disrupted by COVID-19 which is quite disheartening for many of them. What we wanted to portray is actually to make sure that the students and their families do not miss out on such significant and crucial event. So we sat down with SMU to brainstorm the idea of a fun virtual graduation event. One of the challenges when it comes to online events is that participants did not feel the significance of such an event. So we wanted to ensure that our students feel involved in the event and they can be proud of their achievements in their journey with SMU. And this virtual tour houses the content of students submitted photos and videos in which the fellow students can vote for their favourite photo or video. The second experience is the mobile AR photo booth in which they can take the photo with their avatar together with their friends, together with their family as though they are actually in their student gown. And the third experience, it is a representation of the actual ceremony in which the student will walk up on stage and they will shake hands with the dean and collect their certification. This being a social era, people are very active on social media. So we thought to provide them an interesting bit of content that they could share with their friends as well as have a little bit of fun with. The first step in creating this project was we had to create gowns for each different school. That was six schools. So we started off the process with creating the gowns in uh, Maya, which is a 3D application that we use. And then we sent it off to Unity where it will be implemented in the virtual graduation hall. It was quite challenging by itself because we hadn't created such a big scale gathering in a virtual space before. So we had to create a virtual graduation hall uh, with 300 plus students inside and all generated during one time. So that was a huge challenge to maintaining and optimizing the models so that it can run smoothly. Second challenge what we had was we had to figure out a way how to take all the student selfies and create 3D generated heads and apply it in 3D virtual space. We came up with an innovative solution for this problem. Uh, we took the selfies of the students that were given and then we tried to create a 3D generated avatar with a single front-facing picture and then we applied a 3D animation to it and packaged everything and projected it live during one time in a 3D virtual space. We faced several challenges converting the models into AR compatible format. So there was actually a lot of trial and error uh, when it comes to writing the custom scripts in order to export the models into the correct formats. What we needed to do was to generate a unique QR code for each student and from there was to pass the information directly to the phone so we could generate the avatar immediately and the student didn't need to key in any additional information after scanning the QR code and they could just generate the avatar in AR. This project has shown that uh, you know it is very possible to create individualized personalized immersive technology experiences for an individual compared to a very passive experience. This introduces not only elements of fun, but they can interact and uh, modify their content how they wish to and it is personalized so they can see that it is something that they can relate to. In the future, we hope that virtual Vata generation can be more accessible so that everyone uh, can enjoy interacting with everyone else in a virtual space. Especially in this current situation of the pandemic, we might not be able to gather in large groups for any important events for quite some time. This immersive solution will help to eliminate any problems arising now due to this distancing issue or any time in the future. <laughs>